Another issue we need to consider with insulators is tracking. If we have a potential voltage difference across an insulator, it will limit the current flowing through it due to its high resistivity. As the voltage increases, the electricity can't pass through it, so we'll try and go round the outside of the insulator. This is called tracking. This tends to be an issue when the system voltage gets to a high level, above 36 kV, and when the insulator is located outside and subjected to rain and or pollution that sticks to the outside of the insulator, creating a lower resistance path for the electricity. One way to reduce the effect of tracking is to increase the distance around the outside of the insulator. By increasing the linear distance that the electricity needs to flow from one side to the next, we make it more difficult for tracking to occur. If we want to use the insulator for a higher voltage, we can simply stack the insulators in series. Here is a stack of insulators from a transmission line. If you look at the individual insulator, we can see that it's been designed to minimise tracking, as the shape that's formed makes the electricity travel as far as possible around the outside. Here we have a post insulator from a substation. This post insulator is designed to operate outdoors and may be subject to pollution over many years. The shape of the post insulator minimises the effect of tracking.